morning guys it is day 20 um january 20th 2015 it's like 8 30 in the morning right now and i woke up really sad today so i don't know just like sad and nostalgic and whatever so i am trying to not give into it uh but i think me being like keeping so busy and ignoring all the sadness is actually what's making it all catch up to me now i don't know whatever but i am just going to stay busy and not think about anything yeah so i'm the video last night did not finish uploading the diy video it had like 3,000 and something minutes. I don't know what was wrong with my internet last night. So I'm finishing uploading it now. I'm kind of upset that it's late, but what are you going to do? Um, and I'm making the thumbnail right now. What I want to get done today, I definitely want to film two videos. So I'm going to film my Spanish video for Saturday today. And I'm going to film my video for tomorrow today. And I want to get tomorrow's video edited. So Saturday's video I'm going to film this morning while Noelle is not here. And then the other video I can do um, later when he gets home. So let me make this thumbnail. Um, so those are the two work... Oh, and get my blog post up for today. Those are the two work things that I really want to get done today. Um, bring forward. Beside that... There's a couple of other, like, just things I want to get done. I want to clean and, like, throw out stuff in my closet and shit because I think that's going to help make me feel better. Um, you guys know I love purging, so I want to purge some stuff. I canceled my appointment today for the insurance with the adjuster because I am going to call them up and try to get it switched to my mechanic because it's just easier and closer and I don't have to go anywhere. Um have to go to the supermarket later to the bank what else that's it those are like and then just send out some emails and messages and stuff so those are the most important things that i want to kind of get done today and then i'm just gonna take some time to like i don't know well now like while nobody's home just sit and reflect and maybe write in my journal or something just i don't know get some stuff out I feel I feel weird this morning so uh trying not to let that get to me and I don't know that's kind of pretty I'm here trying to figure out how I'm gonna edit this photo mm, no all right guys uh, I think that's everything for this morning for right now at least and Let's get it together and have a good day. It's not Monday. It feels like Monday, but it's actually Tuesday, so it's going to be a short week, so that's cool. The weather is amazing. Well, it's cold, but it's amazing. It's, like, in the 30s, and it's going to be in the 30s all week, and we're already, like, towards the end of January, so I'm hoping that the worst has already passed. That would be awesome because we had a really bad um, winter last year, so hopefully this one is just not going to be that bad. Um, and that would be bomb. This is looking really pretty. Um, so, no. So, I hope that it just stays like this from now on. I really hope. Um, alright, let me go finish this work, and I'll see you guys in a little while. Alright, guys, um, I haven't gotten much done work-wise. It's about to be 12.30. I kind of had breakfast and started cleaning up around the house and stuff and I just got lost doing that so I want to um I don't know I want to kind of finish that up so I guess I'm just going to film both videos later but um that's good I guess because whatever it's always good to clean up I've officially given up on cleaning my mother's house and having this house be beautiful and spotless and hoarder free 
because it just wasn't worth the stress. You guys saw what I went through in Vlogmas trying to clean it up. And I'm happy that I did what I did, especially like with the food and the cabinets because that was really disgusting. So at least that is good. But it's just not worth the stress for me to go crazy trying to clean her house. And then when I touch anything that's hers, it's like a big problem. And she just makes it messy again anyway. So it was really frustrating. And I'm just like, you know what? Thank God we're like we've set it in our mind that we're leaving in a couple of months so i'm just going to keep my stuff clean at least and just kind of suck everything else up and what are you gonna do so um yeah i was cleaning up i like vacuums in here in this room and in my room and in the dining room because for some reason even though the dining room is not technically one of my rooms i just she doesn't really use that room, so I like to keep it clean, even though I'm not allowed to have anybody over. If I was, I would be having, like, dinner parties all the time, because we have a really nice dining room. But I'm not allowed to have anybody over the house, like, anybody at all. Like, she doesn't even invite my brothers over the house, which is <laughs> crazy. Um, but yeah, so I cleaned, I uh, vacuumed the dining room, too, just because I'm, like, partial to that room. Because it's one of the semi-nice rooms in the house plus I cleaned it all up so it's like even nicer now um I don't know I like clean things guys I'm I'm partial to clean stuff so I clean up the floor here I am pre-packaging the giveaway prizes for my 100k giveaway just because the prizes are like so big and they're like really big boxes and stuff like look um those are the first place prize for in YouTube and for Instagram so I need to get another box for the U the Instagram prizes but I want to have it like kind of pre-packaged I want to get cards as well and um, write out some nice cards for the winners and I want to have that I don't know I guess I'll just leave it I'll pre-package it all together and leave it like maybe under the table in the dining room because like I said we don't use that room anyway so I'll leave it under the table so it's like out of the way until the giveaway ends which I think is in a week or so it ends at the end of January so once it ends and I know the winners then I can seal it up and ship it off but I just want it in a box and out of the middle because it's been sitting there since I filmed the video and I'm just like over it um so I'm gonna package all of that and I'm gonna put together the other I think there's three other prizes or maybe there's more two. I think there's three other smaller prizes so I'm gonna put that together as well today um, still gonna go to the supermarket. Okay, I I told you guys I was in like a sad mood this morning, so I've been watching. This is what I do when I'm upset. I actually typed in, can you see, inspiration for manifesting, and just to see what would come up, I'll type in like all different stuff. So I'm watching this huge inspiration from Life, Class, and Oprah. I'm watching that video right now. Um, I'm about halfway through, and I do feel better. And it did motivate my little ass to get shit done and to pull myself out of my bad mood, so that helps. But I'll just get on YouTube and I'll type random stuff like, feel good, be in a good mood, inspiration, go for your dreams, manifesting, blah, 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 like just random words. And I'll just watch whatever jumps out at me. Um, and yeah, that helps my mood, so that's what I've been doing to kind of pull my shit together today. Um... I planned out exactly what I'm going to, like, the content of what I'm going to film. Like, I knew the two videos that I'm going to film, but I wasn't sure what look I was going to do for the Spanish video and stuff like that. So I planned that out. What else have I done this morning? Oh, I got to go to the supermarket. So this is my current dilemma. So we're all, like, excited because this month so far has been good financially. Um, and I have what I wanted to have saved and a little bit more so that's totally awesome the only problem is every bit of income like I paid my bills because I told you I pay my bills off like a few days the last couple of days of the month I pay my bills for the next month that way everything is done so I paid my bills off um I had some leftover money I got my new phone with that I took Noel to ice skating the first time um Yesterday, I paid for the the obstacle course he did, whatever. So I did a couple of activities with my leftover money, but now we're, like, down to $7 in the bank, and every 
thing that I'm getting income wise, I'm just saving in my rent folder. So I'll show you guys my rent folder. It says rent money and a little heart on it. Um, and then on the back, I wrote like in December, I had $600 from December. So I wrote that and January 1500 is my goal and then blank for extra. So um, once I put it like so far, I only have December's money in here. So once I put the rest of the money in here, I'm going to write like at the end of January, whatever extra I put in and just keep like a total. So February 1500 goal blank extra all the way to June to save. Um, so this is my system. I don't know. <laughs> and the problem now is that every little bit of income that trickles my way, I just want to put it in the envelope and I don't want to use anything. And that's all perfectly fine and dandy if it was just me because I could literally sit at home and not go out, not put gas on my car and eat like 25 cent ramen every day and water from the faucet. <laughs> um, but I really got to go to the supermarket. I have to buy milk for Noel. I have to buy juice boxes for um, his snack. Um, I have to get some fruit because I've really been craving fruit. And um, I have to... I, I got to get fruit. I'm, I'm here trying to justify like, oh, but don't get it because you're craving it. Fruit is good. I need fruit. I need to eat. Um, and I got to get like the gallons of water. They're only a dollar each. So I really need to stop. I think I have to take like a hundred dollars. It's January 20th. I have to take $100 aside from what I want to save and just pray that God is going to put it back in and use that for the supermarket and save it for when I need gas in my car. Even though I put I put $30 of gas in my car yesterday, um, which is why I'm left with $7 right now, but I put that in yesterday and it filled up my tank. But from here to the end of the month, I might need to put more. What? Let me see. Am I really driving anywhere this week? Um, tomorrow we have an event at YouTube Space in the evening, right? Wait, where's my plan? Okay. Yeah, tomorrow we have an event at YouTube Space, and I think Wendy's going, so afterwards I'm probably going to drive uptown with her so we could um have a little planning session and just inspire and motivate each other because I think we both need a pick-me-up. Um, so I'm going to be driving tomorrow, Thursday, nothing's going on on Thursday, Friday, nada, this weekend, one of the, like either Saturday or Sunday, I have a feeling something was going on Thursday or Friday and I'm forgetting. Well, whatever, Saturday or Sunday, I have to meet up with, um, Chris who helps me with some of my fashion videos cause we're going to film a very special video for you guys. I'm really excited, but I'll tell you more about it when we're filming. But it's a huge topic, and I think you guys are going to love it, and I think it's going to be a pretty successful video, and I hope it is, because I need this. Um, this, okay, this is next week. There's an event next week. Okay. Um, yeah, so I might actually be able to rock for the rest of the month with what I have in, of gas in my car right now. But we're also taking a road trip. That's what I want to tell you guys. So not this weekend, next weekend. Um, I'm going to take a road trip with some familiar, well, I'm not sure how many of us are going, but one or maybe more familiar YouTube faces. But we're just going to go upstate and we're going to go chill with some friends that are in college. So basically we're staying at the dorm. We don't have to pay a hotel or anything like that. All we have to pay is like gas to get up there and they're going to chip in on gas with me, which is awesome. So basically I'm getting a vacation and all I have to pay is for like the gas and whatever food I feel like eating, but I'll probably be in McDonald's at the dollar menu if I feel like being cheap. Um, I have no problems, guys. Let me tell you, when I buckle down and I'm ready to be cheap, like to, like I won't be cheap just for the hell of it. But if I'm saving up for something or there's something more important, my ass will be the cheapest person in the world, and we'll still look cute and we'll still get it together and we'll just do it the old-fashioned DIY. Drink a lot of water, <laughs> like I don't know, whatever. I'm excited. Um, but yeah, we have a road trip coming up. It's gonna be the last weekend of this month, and it's also gonna be. Not the first time, but I'm leaving Noel to sleep over his dad's house. So we spoke about this before. I'm a little bit apprehensive. He stayed over before um, when I went to L.A. for different events. So the first time I went to L.A., he was supposed to stay the whole time. I think I stayed like 
three nights and four days, something like that. Because I know I stayed the weekend for the events, and then I stayed an extra day just to explore and be a tourist by myself. Um, but I left him with his dad. He stayed the first night, and then his dad had to bring him back home to my mom for the weekend. And then he, he, he just didn't want to stay. He was crying the whole time under the table. And then he um, picked him back up on Sunday night until I came home Tuesday morning because my mom my mom had to go to work uh we have available on any do you have a preference mm -hmm. yeah. oh okay cool thanks um Ooh. okay so whatever that was the first time and then the next times again he did like half at my mom half with my mom and half over there and I think honestly the only reason he likes staying home with my mom is because it's home because he he's in his environment he has his toys it's like all his stuff and he feels more comfortable but honestly they treat him really well over there like I think they treat him better over there than my mom just doesn't have patience for him so Plus, she's always complaining that when she has to watch him, she has other better things to do and whatever. So I'm like, you know what? I want him to be comfortable going over there because they treat him really good. And Junior's mom is like, she's such a sweetheart. I have lunch, which I didn't even eat yet. I'll probably eat it later. I'll save it for when, when I after I pick up Noelle. I didn't even eat yet, guys. Um, but she, yeah, she yesterday heard I was coming over made food for me like made what I like and made extra so that I could have some to take home because I was like I tell I talked to her about a lot of stuff so we were talking and I'm like telling her what's going on with my mom and stuff and she like asked if me and Noelle were eating and I'm like you know we can't cook in the house so it's basically like whatever I can microwave and she's really big they're Dominican so they're really big on being well fed and well nourished so she's like that was like the biggest sin ever for her and she's like oh my god I made extra food you're taking some home so you could have lunch tomorrow like she's really sweet so I know she kind of stays on top of Noel and takes care of him and stuff so I know he's well taken care of over there even if I mean Junior takes care of him but Junior gets a little bit spacey and Junior gets in, like, his own world, and Noel, Noel is like a tornado. He'll really, like, do circles around his dad, and his dad is there, like, do 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 like, oh, wait, what happened? I hate that. That's why I don't trust him with the baby by themselves, and I tell him all the time, I'm like, show me that I can trust you so you can, you know, help me more or spend more time with him, just you guys, but now Noel is getting a little bit older, so I feel like he's five almost six. Oh my god my baby's going on six already <gasps> jesus christ so i feel like he is old enough to basically come back home and report everything that happened if his dad didn't take care of him the way he was supposed to like i'm gonna find out about it so i'm like okay we can do this now so we're gonna try this is the first time that i'm leaving him not because i have to because the other times like i had to go to la for events and work and stuff this is the first time I'm leaving him because I'm giving him the chance. So instead of staying home and crying the entire time, like I probably would have done without Noelle, um, I'm taking a road trip. So I'm only going to be maybe five hours north. Um, maybe less from Junior because Junior's pretty north already. But yeah, we're... We're just going to enjoy it. We're going to have fun and we're going to enjoy it. And that's it. That's it. I'm just going to enjoy the experience. I always wanted to do a road trip with my friends, so we're doing a little mini road trip. We're going away. Um, I haven't been to college parties in, like, maybe two years, so that's going to be fun, too. And we're just going to enjoy life. Yes. <laughs> Trying to convince myself of things. Okay. Ah, this corset. I can't sit like this anymore. <sighs> oh, it stretch. Oh, okay. I should watch that video next. Learn how to silence your mind. Oprah Winfrey interviews Jill Bolt Taylor. Yeah, I'm going to watch that one because I need to do that. All right, so that is what is going on today. Right now, plans got a little bit shifted, but I'm still going to keep track of everything on my to-do list. Um, it's not too much stuff, so we're, we're good. And we're going to get work done. And we're going to do this. This is, today is going to be a good day. Today is going to be a good day. Okay? 
we're gonna have we're all gonna have some nice cool unexpected surprise this week that's gonna make us really happy that it's gonna come out of like left field that we totally were not expecting and it's gonna put like the biggest smile on our faces and we're not even gonna realize it and then when we're there like cheesing super hard we're gonna be like oh we were just talking about this in the vlog. We're going to have a surprise this week, and this is the surprise. And then it's all going to, like, dawn on us. And we're going to be like, oh, shit, yay. Um, so that is my wish for myself and for all of you this week. And uh, that's it. I will vlog when I pick up <gasps> my God, Noelle, and when we get to the supermarket. Can you stop? Really? All the cute stuff they have. Amina. And there's cute stuff over Supermarket. here. Supermarket. I couldn't help myself. I got some dough Um, I found some meat for like two dollars. I'm cooking today. I don't care what she says. Cookies, some fruit down there. Snacks for Noel to bring to school. Two hot chocolates, so I can stop complaining that I don't like the one at home. Milk, juice, boxes, and juice. Can you get me something here? Not today, baby. I'm getting you the the clings for the. The, for the window, those are really pretty. Go, Camina. Uh, not today, Noel. Let's go, please. Noel, leave it. Noel, we gotta come back when Easter gets closer to get to get Easter stuff. Oh, do I? Um, I think I'm out of peanut butter. Uh, whatever. Let's check. Noel. Okay, I need some hands to steer, guys. Okay. No, I made a show for me. The rescue, I'm here. The armrest? Yeah. Hey, that's mommy's milk. Milk, a and paper towel? Yeah, to clean your mouth. Thank you. <laughs> what is this show about? Uh, you. Okay. <laughs> Careful. Mommy. Mommy, you're so beautiful. Mommy, be careful. Mommy, you're so beautiful. I love you. I love you. I simply love you. I remember my you Mommy, mommy, I simply, simply love you. Oh, mommy, oh, mommy, you are so, so beautiful. Be careful. I love mom. you, I love you, I love you, my mommy. I love you, 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 yeah, 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 I love you. Are you getting out of breath there? Almost. Done. Mm -hmm. why, can't, why don't you want to take okay, a sip? Okay, I'll take a sip. Mommy, oh, I love you. Oh, I love, love, love you. Mommy, I love you. Mama, ma, mommy, I love you. I love you. I love you. It's a long s song, so... If you need to go to a bathroom, I'll pause. <laughs> it's okay, I don't have to go to the bathroom. But you're drinking milk. <laughs> yeah, but it's okay. <laughs> mommy, oh mommy, oh mommy. Mommy, oh mommy, you're so sweet. Mommy, 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 you bring... Be careful, no. You bring very much for joy. Mommy. Oh, mommy, bring my life with joy. Mommy, you are so sweet. Oh, mommy, yes you are. <laughs> mommy, I love you. I love you, love you. Simply love you. Mommy, oh, mommy. Mommy, 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 <laughs> mommy, mommy, mommy. Mommy, I love you. Mommy, oh mommy. Mommy, you bring my life with joy. Mommy, 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 I love you. Mommy, I love you. 
I did peace and be love you. Why aren't you showing them this? I am showing them you. Mommy, mommy, <laughs> you feel my life with joy. Mommy, mommy. Be careful with life. grandma's stuff. Joy. Mommy, oh mommy. No, el cuidado. Mama, mama, mommy, mommy, mommy. Mommy, I love you. Mommy, you bring my heart with joy. Heart with joy. Heart with joy. Mommy, you bring me heart with joy. I love you. Simply love you. Mommy. Oi, Noel, get down from there. Get down now. Do it on the floor. Do the show on the floor. Mommy, Mommy I can't bounce. No, don't bounce. Mommy, Mommy. Joy. Stop yeah, I don't want you on there anymore. Noel, I'm gonna turn the camera off. I'm not gonna Mommy, vlog. Careful. No, you're gonna uh, fall. Noel, this song has been like five minutes already. Mommy, Wrap it up. It's ten minutes. No. Yes, it is. Okay, but I don't want you jumping on the couch anymore. Okay, I'll walk. Mommy, mommy. You feel my life with joy. I'm just zooming by itself. Are you done? No. How many more minutes do I have? You have no more minutes. I said ten. You have no more minutes. Wait. Mommy, oh mommy, I love, 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 love you. Thank nice. You. Get off. Thank get you. off. Thank you. Mwah. Thank you for coming to my stage today. Mwah. The song is over. Yay! Woohoo! Yay! Now, do you want to buy something? No, there's a gift shop. No, thank you. You don't need to pay. Oh, free souvenirs? Yeah. Okay. What would you like? Well, I don't want to say I have it yet because it's a work in progress, but I'm. Should add this into my vlog when I'm trying to film and they're screaming. I'm filming and you sound crazy.